Out of there all, Zay's here yet again. Sorry about that, I realized my mic was a little quiet in the last episode. I'll get it down eventually. But uh, I turned the in-game volume down slightly, so hopefully it's a little bit better for you and you're not fighting with what you need. Sorry, and you're not fighting with your audio, just trying to hear me better. <clears throat> But now that that's taken care of, a good thing you're going to want and something you can put, start putting down immediately is food crops. And I don't think zombies can destroy your crops. They can uh, walk on them and it's annoying. It's a nightmare sometimes because uh, crawlers sometimes will get some of your plants. I'm gonna craft a spike baseball bat really quick. All you need is a hammer, nails, and bat. And instead of doing 10 damage, just 12.5, and it repairs it slightly. Oh, sorry about that, I sneezed real quick. I don't know if you guys wanted to hear that. Oh, it makes a different sound when it hits. So, but anyway, what you're gonna need to find next is a trowel and a watering can, preferably. Oh, that's handy. Which, I will take those shotgun shells back out, because I want to show you guys something else. Remember what I did with the 9mm rounds? You can do the same thing with shotgun shells, except it's 24. And the main reason you do that, I don't know if I ever highlighted it. Each shotgun shell is 1 pound. See how that says 0 0.3, the other one is 24, you're dropping 2.5 pounds. So, it's a very high advantage. Carpentry for beginners and carpentry for intermediates. Those are both perfect and are going to help very much. Always grab the skill books that you can. Notebook, sheet of paper, magazine, etc. Okay, I'm back. And honestly, I have no idea what I was saying. Besides maybe something about a box of shotgun shells. Sorry. Oh, right. I just got some loot books, I think. Or some... You know what I'm saying. My apologies. I worked. Trying to keep that off the mic. And then I just go ahead and say it. So. Okay. Anyway. Time to go back to a garage and try and find that trowel I was talking about. Because what you'll need... Some of them hurt. Is... Those... C packets that you see, shockingly, you can use as seeds. And you can start making your own renewable food source. And um, I was confused at this at first. You know, how do you just harvest it? It eventually goes through, I believe, five stages. It goes through seedling, young, mature, harvestable. And then finally, seed bearing. And you want to wait until it gets to... Oh, holy damn! Sorry. I got an axe. It's... In my opinion, it's one of the best melee weapons. And it can chop down those trees I was talking about. So if there's a trowel in here too somewhere, then we just... Oh dear. Oh! <gasps> Zombie. Stop trying to bite me. Did she succeed? No. Okay, we're good. Okay. No, but here's another battery, flashlight, and nails. As of right now, pip clips don't do anything, so ignore them. So I'm pretty sure. Oh dear Jesus! Oh dear. No. Away with you. And I got two more. Might as well. Okay. Now, nails. All this. Perfect. 
Okay, duct tape, fishing tackle, sky... I would grab planks, but since I can cut down trees now, there's really no point. Nails, more fishing traps. Sometimes there's a trowel in here. That sounds horrifying, doesn't it? I don't even know where to grab these seed packets. And that lighter, excellent. Pepper, instant popcorn, and empty this whiskey bottle. Okay, pour on ground, fill empty bottle. This way I don't have to drink all the time. This is there. Might as well grab an apple in the fridge. I gotta do this fast. Okay. Got the cereal chips. I, by the way, don't grab the dog food. It just makes your character incredibly unhappy. So, I mean, I mean, you can if you want, if you have a lot of things that boost your happiness. Trow, fuck yeah. Okay, I'm back to my house. I'm gonna read a carpentry book and finish boarding up all of these windows, and I'll get back to you when I do. See you in a minute.